Yo, what's going on everybody? My name is Veiko and today we're going to do Pokemon Sword and Shield ranked double battles and in today's video I have something truly special for you guys. The Players Cup happened, uh, Players Cup 2 qualifiers were last weekend and we're going to be using Yuki Chaninovich's team. Hopefully I pronounce it correctly if you don't, guys don't know who he is. Um, top 24 team uh, is is this team it's a rental team I'll put the code for you in the description uh, it's a really cool team it features the Dragobolt uh, which used to be so good but Carthana, Tapofini, Rodom, Heat such a good Pokemon right now Mamoswine and Grimmsnarl top 24 in the toughest toughest online tournament ongoing right now but without further ado, let's rent the team and uh, go on to the ranked ladder, shall we? Like, I really want to use the Tragabolt, that's why I chose the team. It's, it's such like Tragabolt Mammoth Wine, but... Moltres is kind of a problem for that team. Am I right? Rodom Heat looks really good here. It always does. It's such a good Pokemon in the current current meta game. Maybe I'll start with this, I think. Cartana could be good here too, but let's just see what happens. Players Cup qualified 20 in the best 24. Rental team, let's do it. Alright, champion music, I presume, yeah, I think. This could be kind of a difficult one, yeah. They did not lead the Red Shieleki, which I'm kind of surprised. I would have really liked them. There is no, huh, okay, no nasty plot. I don't want the Thunderbolt. Um... I guess I could actually just do this. That could be kind of, kind of a good idea. And let's use the light screen. Maybe we get faked out. Maybe not. Dynamaxing Rodan without nasty plot in the beginning is not ideal. I kind of want to use the Dragon Ball, but I think setting up the sun and actually hitting with the, another Max Flare in the sun could be really good. They might not even go for a light screen in the beginning, because they're not expecting. Dynamaxi Moltres is, is always scary. It's such a hard hard Pokemon to deal with. I don't want to use Lightning on it or Spirit Break or anything like that. There's definitely a weakness policy there. So we do need to be careful. Let's see, maybe I'm playing this wrong. Take out, yep. There's not much I can do about that. Probably max airstream into Grimmy. Grimmy Grim. Fortunately for us, this one has good defenses. It's bulky. Hopefully we can surprise with the max flare a little bit. This should do a lot more than that. This is not an offensive Rodan, but it's it's not the end of the world. I can still live with this. Still think we're gonna go for that light screen. Rodan's still sitting pretty safe here. That's not smart, much they can do. They did increase the speed, but that's not that relevant for us. They did not drop the special defenses, and they are thinking that <laughs> this is not what they were expecting. They are thinking. Yeah. What do you do? I should have maxed throughout the Grim Snow, but... Shoulda, woulda, coulda. Probably another screen. Okay, they're just going for it. But now they don't have Protect, and they, they kinda did waste the max turn. So did I, but... Let's see, that Airstream boost is kinda unfortunate also, because now Tragabout probably can't outspeed. Um, 
We do have focus task, now the question is, can we KO this? I think I'm just gonna go for it and we'll see how this battle is gonna turn up. This is looking like a <laughs> not such a good battle for us, but we'll see. They are thinking, they're definitely confused. <laughs> What's going on? Why did the road a max? Oh, that nasty blood was so free in the beginning also. We'll see. Perfect, perfect. Fake tears in the mammoth swine. He didn't ask for anything better. Nice, nice, in the mammoth swine. Beautiful, beautiful. This actually might work. <laughs> this might actually work, we'll see. Hopefully it does. If it doesn't, we're going to be in trouble. Come on. Come on. Nice. <laughs> uh, there's still a very strong chance for Justin to lose this battle, but we're already one Pokemon down, but that's... I guess we'll take those. I mean, we did get rid of the Moltres, so that's at least something in Season 7 always. Nah, we're still pretty good. There are... Uh, yeah. Grimsnarl does have that speed boost, though. I need to think about that. I might outspeed both of my Pokémon. We'll maybe. It's not my own team, so it's kind of hard to know the speed tiers, but yeah. Interesting choice, to say the least. Huh. Let's see. They have to be tempted to go after Mamoswine here. I don't think Rodom Heed is in a huge trouble here. Probably going to eat a Spirit Breaker or something to lower its special attack, but... I'm curious how much this Thunderbolt will do first, we'll see. Maybe I should have done something else. Maybe an overheat in the sun. Oh, okay, oh wow. Alright. Wow. I didn't know Regila Gigat. I should have went for an earthquake, why, what the... <laughs> what? Ancient power, makes sense, it is a legendary Pokemon, but that's fine. That is fine, my friends. We are getting outsped by everything. It is not looking very good for us, us, us. <sighs> Earthquake there should have still made our day, but what are the chances they're not gonna go after? Mamos won this turn, they have to go after Mamos won this turn. Let's see, this is a little bit weird. A little bit of a weird team. Yeah. They got me. They got me good there. They got me good there, maybe the Earthquake could have balanced the scales, but I don't think there's much we can do now. Just D-Dart or Phantom Force or I don't know. I I think he got this one. Or she. Well... Ancient power is... that is curious, although it's really weak. Unless you use fake tears. Let's see, if the Dragon Darts KO, we have a chance. Nope. Nope. Chance we do not have. They should be going for a Spirit Break. I guess I get kind of dodged that. But... What do I do after that? I don't know. Yeah, I'm the wave. Ah, uh, yeah. There's no way we can pull this one off. Well, we are still trying.
I gotta say, this wasn't too difficult of a match. Uh, just maybe a little bit in inexperience with the team and uh, yeah. Let's we'll we'll give him this one. No no more sense of <laughs> continuing this, but let's let's try another one, shall we? All right, my friends, let's do this. Let's do this. That is a weird team for sure. Weird, I mean, dangerous and strong. Reggie Gigas, Moltres, Landerus, Galarian Weezing, like. Can you even create a better team? That's just full of strong, strong and dangerous Pokemon. Although... Oh, it's so when I use Dragon Ball and Mamoswine, but... That... Moltres is kind of a problem, isn't it? Other than that, it's not a bad lead. Cartana looks pretty good here too. Cartana and... Uh, Did I, could I do that? Cartana, Tragabolt, Mamoswine, and Rota. Let's let's see if we can make something happen here. Regigigas, Moltres, one of the best Pokémon's in currently. It is. It was interesting why while I was watching the Players Cup too that not many. I don't think any. I could be wrong. Reggie Gigas really made it to the very, very top. There were Reggie Gigas in the tournament for sure, but they really didn't make it to the all the way to the top ladder. You could argue it's one of the best Pokemons in the format, but that is interesting. What's happening here? Okay. It's just. Alright. I do know the Weezing does something with the. Neutralizing gas for Reggie gas. It has an ability or, or something. I could go after the wheezing, but what is the wheezing really gonna do here? It could go for a strange beam, but that is kind of an obvious protect if I ever saw one. Um, I could lower the defenses, but actually lowering the attacks, that could be good too. Let's see. No need to increase the speed, I don't think, this time. We have a pretty fast board here, depending on how Cardana's trained. I could have targeted the Weezing, but I have a feeling they're committed on using Regigigas, and... Uh, there's a high chance Weezing will just protect, and to be honest, it's not a great threat to us right now. It can proc our weakness, policy, and trackable, and uh, it can't do pretty much anything against Cartana, so... Yes, they're going to Dynamax for sure. Let's see how beautiful matchup Trackable is, is against Richie Gigas. I could have went for a Max Phantasm. Lower the defenses, but we'll see. Was this a bad idea to go after Regigigas? We'll see. Yeah. Obvious, obvious, obvious protect or switching. Weezing is doing nothing here but using neutralizing gas, so lower the attack stat. Not a bad amount of damage, not a bad amount of damage, but the attack, lowering attack should be the key here. Let's see if there's a weakness policy there. Or if it outspeeds Cardano, it does. Ice Punch. That's still a lot of damage even after the attack drop. But that should favor us because we have a weakness policy. Nice. So, should a Max Burn Wind KO now? What is that? Let's see how much this does. I think that's in a KO range. Now, the question is they could protect Regigigas and go after. Tragabolt with Weezing. That is a bit scary, but... I think that's still what I'm going to do. Fortunately, I can't. Max Airstream... Um, cause 
Um, let's see. Does it even have a max guard? It should, but it's it's not definitive. Let's see. I don't want the trackable to be KO'd, but th they are thinking. They are thinking for sure. They do withdraw. That is that is respectable. <laughs> Retrowing or Dynamax Reggie Gigas, but that's just how much pressure we're putting. And it's going to be Moltres, not not something fairy that can take the max, max burn win. So we'll see. That's a lot of damage. That's a KO, my friends. That is a KO. Trackable making a comeback. Come on, Cartana. I think your attack stat is 180 or something. Super effective. Do it. Ooh, very interesting. Come on. Is that a strange beam into? Interesting, interesting. Willow Wisp. So Trackable is alive. Trackable is alive and dangerous as ever. Let's see what they're going to do. I think Cardana is still pretty good, even with the burn. It's still really fast. I think it can still probably deal with both Weezing and the Richie Gigas, depending on how this is gonna turn out. They have a Cartana of their own. Um, Let's go after here. I think there's no reason not to do this. Maybe they switch in the Rechikikas. That could be quite the play, but... Yeah, we're using protects, that's why I targeted Cartana. Because we think really not doing anything here. It's got a bad matchup, so there's not much <laughs> else to do than protect. I could have max air streamed, but Defense Drop could be useful too on Weezing, let's see. They are faster. They do not get the KO. Nice. And Weezing is just protected. We have to remember that. Unfortunately, Richie Gigas does outspeed Kartana now, I think. And can we really do anything about Weezing with Dragobolt? Hmm. But I really do like this team. I really, really do like this team. Um. Let's see. I do have a plan. I know that I know there's a definite win win con for me, but I'm. Oh, it's early morning. I'm too tired to think, but I I think I have a plan. Maybe I could have put a little bit, bit more effort to this, but because we're using protected, right? So I think we can protect Rodam and maybe just Phantom Force in here. But Weezing just protected, so I could use... oh... Because if I use Dragon Darts, they could still protect Regigiga, so I think this is pretty safe here. Let's see... I'm also curious what, what moves the opponent is going to use. Ice Punch and Strange Beam, so they definitely wanted <laughs> to go after Dragobolt, so Weezing is in trouble now. No Protect from Regigigas either. Weezing should be gone here. And the Thunderbolt should seal the game, I think. It's a little bit more accurate than Overheat, well, 100% accurate, so... This should be the game, I think. There's not much they can do, yeah. But Phantom Force hits through Protect, so... Weakness Policy Dragon Bolt. Hey, come back. Season 7, not bad, not bad. That 140... ...something speed stat is still really, really good, even though Rich Gigas is, is now the fastest one in the format. Dragon Bolt's still really good. 
Hey, we take the victories. It's not one of the best teams in the world right now for for nothing. Team ID is in the description. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed. I had a really, really good time. Yeah, have a wonderful rest of the day. Hope you guys enjoyed. Feel free to comment below what did you think about the video, the team, are you going to use the team or yourself. Have a wonderful rest of the day and see you on the next video. Bye bye.